One local school district is celebrating a big achievement. The latest school performance report from the North Carolina Department of Public Instruction shows Beaufort County is no longer a low performing district. RN Jenkins sat down with the superintendent to learn more about what this means for your students in the school system. We're super excited to announce that um, our students performed at a level um, that shows that each one of our schools of elementary and middle school increase their school performance scores. Beaufort County School says they're excited to be back on the right track. We had Elena, Paramecia. Before the pandemic, they had zero low performing schools. The 2022-23 school year showed seven schools in Beaufort County were not meeting expectations. That put them in a low performance status as a district. What number, Mom? Last school year, though, for the 2023-24 school year, the county saw huge growth. Nine of our 12 schools either met or exceeded growth. Chakwin Middle School and Northeast both came out of low performance. Our elementary schools, in terms of their school performance scores, are increasing. We had three schools actually hit a seven point jump overall. These numbers are all based on student test scores. This is typically looking at mathematics, English language arts, science. This achievement means students are better prepared for what comes next, no matter the grade level. What we typically look at in a pre K through 12 system is how how do we prepare students for life after high school, either for enrollment, enlistment, employment, whatever it might be? Do they have the skill sets to be able to move on? And so those skill sets are so essential at younger grade levels in order to really gain success moving into the upper grade levels. Superintendent Dr. Matthew Cheeseman says this growth is a testament to the hard work by everyone in their schools, especially the teachers in the classrooms. I think these scores are representative that we've grown a culture inside of our district that our employees, our educators, our staff, our support staff, our administrators embrace children from the moment they get on the bus, to the moment they come into our schools, to the moment that they step out. We're going to keep that momentum of making sure that kids come to a really great learning environment. School leaders say the success also takes your help at home. Let's continue to read with them, ask them what they know, what they're doing, check for their understanding. But the biggest thing, especially in a low performing school, is to make sure students are there every single day. In Beaufort County, Aaron Jenkins, nine on your side.